We live in the 21st century. Technology has drastically changed over the decades. We've begun to use technology for anything and everything. If we need an answer to a question, no one says, just look it up or read a book. Everyone says, just Google it. Now, this isn't necessarily an issue. In fact, technology has become an amazing feature in our society. But there is life beyond Apple products. Books are still out there. Students in the classroom need to be taught to problem solve, and teachers need to teach them by simple lectures and one-on-one -on -one teaching, because sitting behind an iPad and emailing out projects just isn't quite enough. Society's idea of teaching and learning has been corrupted by technology. We must promote the one-on-one -on -one teaching and bring back the student-teacher relationships to CISD, one classroom at a time. Some people may think, why go back to the old school methods? Relying on technology can be harmful, though. Creative and open mind thinking needs to be promoted in the classroom, not just sitting behind a message in a screen board. We still need to use real world, real world communication. And in fact, when you have a job, when you're older, you're not just going to be sitting behind a computer screen communicating. You have to have the one-on-one -on -one communication skills. Even uh, Troy Williams of Macklemind New Adventures said that many com companies have not been able to see an increase in grades or academic performance since technology has been added to the classroom. Like I said, technology plays a major role in our society. Just in 2009, the National Center for Education states that 90% of teachers said that they use computers in their classrooms. Students as young as pre-K are being exposed to computers and pushing aside books and common literature. I'm not saying that technology is a bad thing. In fact, it is a great thing, but what if we use one-on-one -on -one communication and technology together in the classroom? Perhaps teachers still lectured and students still took notes, but then we use technology solely for presentations. That all being said, I'm going to leave you with an image. Imagine the world 50 years from now. Students and workers across the world have forgotten how to use proper communication because technology has taken over the classroom and the workspace. Help prevent this from ever happening. Spread the word and join the campaign. Together, let's bring back one-on-one -on -one teaching, one classroom at a time.